Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. So first of all, this login with your credentials and in the search bar, search for the healthcare. Okay. Healthcare and open this thing in new tab. Okay. Wait for a second. And click on this enable API now this is going to take a couple of seconds so you can just go to your dashboard and activate your cloud shell because we need the cloud shell in the previous next task okay so this is going to take a couple of seconds so just come on the task number one okay scroll down and from here just copy this name called dataset one for our healthcare okay so now click on this create data set paste the name over here and in the region section just choose the us central one now simply click on create and we are done with the task number one task number one will take couple of minutes to update the score so we can do one thing just search for the iam open this thing in new tab okay just wait for a second over here and here you can see this checkbox called include google provide roles grant click on this once you click on here at last second option healthcare service agent you can see this agent name now just simply click on edit principles and here we have to add some roles so just copy this role click on this plus icon paste and choose wisely okay now again click on add another role copy the name again click on select role paste and choose wisely now click on add another role copy this new role paste over here and done now click on add another role and the last role copy that paste over here and choose okay so it must be look like this now simply click on save so we are done with the task number two also now for the task number three just copy this thing go back to your dashboard and run the command over here just wait for a second and it's done now copy this command run over here wait for a second click on authorize now copy this second command of task number four wait for this command to get executed so it's done now run the second command just scroll down and copy the last command okay of this lab so just once this command get executed we have to run the last command okay now run the last command and just wait okay so it's also done now you can just simply come on the task number one click on check my progress you will get the score without any issue now check the score for task number two okay we got a score now check the score for task number four and if you didn't get a score so do not worry about that sometime lab take a couple of minutes to update a score okay and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day